One of the more interesting days on my second tour in Afghanistan was a day when in the afternoon there was a mortar attack on our base. We encountered a Czech soldier and he was carrying a Belgian Malinois, one of his war dogs. And the dog had a huge open wound of its right hip. So another surgeon and I decided, well, we, can, we know how to deal with bleeding. We don't know much about dogs as far as surgical. I'm used to treating patients in a variety of circumstances, emergency room, operating room, life and death situations. So I understand the emotional tone of that experience. I did find that it was totally different taking care of an injured dog in Afghanistan. Perhaps because a dog is a, a bit of home, if you will. It brought out a very different emotional response by all the individuals participating, which I found interesting as a physician. We stabilized the dog, we found the bleeding, removed what fragments we could, Two helicopters came and picked up the dog. I don't think much more treatment was needed than local wound care, and we did know that within a couple of days, the dog was in Germany and, and doing well, and probably retired from the military and now a civilian uh, dog, with probably a small limp, but otherwise doing okay.